What up YouTube? Wesker Griff coming back with a box break recap for Season 6 of Game of Thrones from Rittenhouse Archives. If you checked out my last video, you know that I picked up two boxes uh, for $45 a box uh, off eBay. Got a really great price on these boxes, so couldn't pass it up. Wanted to uh, bust some more of uh, Season 6 since I don't have that many autographs from this set. And I'll probably be doing a live video for this one to see what I get. Uh, but for this one, I broke it on, uh, just broke it at my own leisure after I got done watching uh, season two of Stranger Things. So I was like, uh, might as well, you know, break open this box, see what I got in here. And got some foils, a um, couple foils, and then I got my stack of base. So still got to go through all the base and everything. Um, then I got my inserts, just. You know, just a few of them. Here's some of the quotables. Uh, we got Sons of Stark there on the back. Uh, then we got the uh, gold inserts, which are numbered out of 150. I pulled the leaf. Then we got the beautiful death, which is probably the best uh, insert subset uh, in the entire product line. It's really cool. And an uh, obvious spoiler on these cards, uh, so... I should have said that earlier. If you are, if you're not caught up on Game of Thrones, don't watch the video. There's spoilers on these cards. Uh, you got the relationship card of uh, Dorne Martell and Ilaria Sand. So those were my inserts, the base and the foils, uh, autographs. Uh, I pulled them early in the box. Like there's 24 packs per box, and I pulled the autos within like the first 10 packs. So the first one here that I got is Joel Fry, who I didn't have, so it's a new uh, autograph for the set. But unfortunately, it's like a five to ten dollar autograph at best. So it's definitely not someone you want to pull. It's one of those like lower end autos. And uh, so then I was like, well, maybe the second auto will redeem the box. <laughs> now uh, it was uh, Sam Coleman who plays Young Hodor, who I already have, and he's another low end auto. He's like a ten dollar card. So I was like, man, this box is horrible. It's not good. Uh, just wasted 45 hours. Like, literally flushed the money down the toilet. Uh, so I'm going through the packs, and I only have two packs left. So I was like, Ugh. I'm just, like, like angrily, like, opening them, just, like, flying through the cards, because I already got my two autos. And Rittenhouse, I've never seen anyone get more than two autos per box. So anyway, I'm going through, I got my last two packs, and I noticed the one pack is kind of thick, so I'm like, ooh, I wonder what could be in here, maybe an extra card or two. But, uh, I pulled this card, and I was like, no way, like, oh my god. I was like, I take back all the stuff I was saying about this box, uh, because this was the Hail Mary, and it is a relic card, and just to let you know, relic cards are only one per case. So, the only way you can get a relic card is if uh, you buy a case, and the seller that I bought it off of broke open a case and was selling them two uh, boxes per. So, enough talking. This is why I pulled. Daenerys Targaryen, authentic piece of her skirt. Little creepy written house, just going to say it now. Yeah, out of all the items, you have to pick the skirt. But, uh, yeah, this is like a $150 to $200 card because this is like the signature card in season six so i was talking with rich breeze and no ain'ts uh we've been talking about this card for i would say like almost a year As he kept asking me if i was going to buy it and i'm like dude i'm not shelling 150 dollars out on a relic card it's just not going to happen i just rather spend that money on an autograph or uh, a sports related item but i said the only way i'm going to get this card is if i pull it and lo and behold the hell mary came through mother of dragons I pulled it, so unbelievable, unbelievable luck, uh, unbelievable streak that I'm on, uh, breaking stuff, I mean, I did the archives box, I pulled the Judge Redemption, which I think there's only like 15 or 20 of them, uh, then I pulled that, the case hit, uh, card from season 6, so who knows what's in this box, maybe there's something crazy, maybe there's not, who knows, but like, it's giving me more of an itch to maybe buy some more products down the line because I have been on fire recently, so that's really cool, and uh, I'm loving it, so I want to maybe buy a few more. Uh, so that's all I got for you guys, so thanks for watching, appreciate you taking the time to watch the video, hope everyone out there is doing well, and peace.